you should want a leader who can tell the truth, even when it's not convenient. It's a basic principle that how well we treat our workers will be a measure of how well our economy does. Because if workers aren't getting paid, then they can't go out and buy the things that are being made. If workers aren't doing well, then business doesn't do well. It's a simple principle that we seem to have forgotten. So it's time for us to go on some offense, but it is going to be hard to do any of this until we finally bring an end to this war in Iraq. We have been talking about this for too long. Now, I want you to be clear now. I want you to be clear so there's no confusion. I was opposed to this war back in 2002. Tom Balanoff and I were on the same stage together. Tom remembers that. At a time when it wasn't popular to be against the war, we were standing up and saying, this is a bad idea. I was opposed to it in 2002. I was opposed to it in 2003. In 2004, I was still opposed to it. And in 2005 and in 2006, this is a war that should have never been authorized and should have never been waged. But SEIU understood that. But we shouldn't we should not compound the original mistake of going in by waiting any longer to pull our troops out. And that's why I have called for starting to withdraw our troops now. Not six months from now, not a year from now. Not five years from now, but now. Let's start bringing our troops home. They've done everything that's been asked of them. They have served us brilliantly. It is time for them to come home. I have said throughout this campaign that this war was ill-conceived, that it was a strategic blunder, and that it needs to come to an end. I have also said that I would be deliberate and careful in how we got out, that I would bring our troops home at a pace of one to two brigades per month, and that that pace we would have our combat troops out in 16 months. But we, shouldn't, we should not compound the original mistake of going in by waiting any longer to pull our troops out. And that's why I have called for starting to withdraw our troops now. Not six months from now, not a year from now, not five years from now, but now. Let's start bringing our troops home. They've done everything that's been asked of them. They have served us brilliantly. It is time for them to come home. You should want a leader who can tell the truth, even when it's not convenient.